so next we will see of structure of nitric oxide okay so nitric oxide formula is no so nitrogen one nitrogen is here so atomic number of nitrogen is 7 oxygen is 8 so the valence electron 2 plus 3 it is 5 2 plus 4 it is 6 so this i have taught already how to write the electronic configuration so in this outermost shell you have to see naka this is outermost shell containing electrons so outermost shell containing electron na 2 plus 3 5 2 plus 4 6 okay already we have seen this so how to write the valence electron total valence electron so now you count the total valence electron how many nitrogen is here one nitrogen into n and then one and then oxygen So one into for nitrogen it is five plus one into six. So five plus six it is eleven. So how to write the nitric oxide? So first you write nitrogen and oxide and put one single bond. Okay. So the single bond contains two electrons. One two. So minus two electron. So how many you will be getting nine. So first fill the most electronegative atom. One two three four five six. Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six, and then the remaining is seven, eight, nine. Okay, so this is a nine. So actually, the octet configuration is so satisfied by the oxygen. First, you have to see the octet configuration, and then you have to see the plus charge and minus charge. Okay, so here octet configuration is satisfied here, whereas this one, this nitrogen is not satisfied the octet configuration because one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So octet is uh, satisfied for which one? Oxygen. Whereas nitrogen, it is not satisfied because one, two, three, four, five. So in order to satisfy the octet role, you have to migrate this. This lone pair will be migrating towards here. So how the structure looks like? Naka the original structure in your book they have given like this. So it is the structure. How to draw? Naka this is oxygen. And this electrons as it is. So the dot 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 structure they are given. No, why the dot dot structure? Na to mention the one electron. To mention the one electron which is present over here, and one lone pair of electron is present over here. They are given this structure. So only this structure is exception with the dot dot structure, and the distance between the nitric nitrogen and oxygen is one hundred and fifteen picometer. Okay. So the next structure we will see of about N two O three. Okay, nitrogen trioxide. So N is nothing but seven. So as it is, the outermost valence electron it is five for nitrogen, oxygen it is six. So here you will see the nitrogen trioxide. So here it is N two O three. So it is nothing but two nitrogen plus three oxygen. So two nitrogen is here, and this is. Three oxygen is here. So two n for this n I have substituted five here. The three oxygen I have substituted six. Why I am substituting this one? You can able to know I think so because I am substituting the valence electron of nitrogen, valence electron of oxygen. Outermost shell containing electron is valence electron. So by doing this one, you will get ten plus eighteen, which is equal to twenty eight. So what I have said for this nitrogen trioxide, you have to put the nitrogen nitrogen and in one place you can write one oxygen and two place another two oxygen so connected by single bond first okay so now you count the electrons how many electrons we have substituted here through the single bond 1 2 3 because one bond contains two electrons one bond contains two electrons so 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 8 so Minus eight in this total valence electron. You have to subtract that one, so you'll be getting twenty pa. So in this, you have to substitute the twenty electrons. So it is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen. So first you complete the oxygen, and then you go to the nitrogen. So eighteen electrons is. I have wrote here the remaining two electrons for this nitrogen. So this is this structure. In what way it can be, to bring the octet role? How the electrons it will be shifting? So first the electron will be shifting like this. In this way it can be shifting. So in this way if it is shifting now, how you will get the structure? So first you have to write the structure as it is. So this two electrons, this two electrons. 
this um, migration of lone pair will be forming as a double bond and this will be as it is. So it is the six electrons and again this migration will be forming as a another electron. So now to put the plus and minus charge. Now see for the oxygen 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Plus and minus charge don't count the electrons over here. For octet rule only you have to see the this fully. Whereas for, to put the plus charge and minus charge you have to see the valence electron for oxygen. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So oxygen it is satisfied. So for nitrogen it is 1, 2, 3, 4. One electron is missing. So you have to put the plus charge over here. Now you see for this one 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So 7 electron is here. So it is excess. So put the minus charge here. See for this oxygen 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So it is balanced. 6 valence electron around the surrounding the oxygen. And then for the nitrogen 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So it is satisfied. So the plus and minus charge will be coming here. So I am writing the same uh, this one that is the same structure here because in different way it is migrating now how the uh, different structure you will get. I will show that one. Listen the same thing I am writing here. Okay. The same thing I am writing here. So how the electrons suppose the shifting if it is in a different way the shifting is in the different way means how the uh, structure will be. So the shifting if it is in a different way. So first it is migrated like this. So second if it is migrated like this means how you will get the structure. Listen. So for this uh, I am writing N bond N this electrons and then oxygen the electrons as it is no change in this. So here you will get the double bond oxygen this electrons and then double bond oxygen this two electron and this four electron. So now you see where the plus charge and minus charge will come. Now you see so it is six seven so it is excess so it is minus. So for this nitrogen one two three four it is missing of one electron so it is plus charge. Now you see for this one 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. It is balanced. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So here it is also 6 electrons. No problem. For this nitrogen 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So no problem. So the plus and minus charge will come here. 